everyone and welcome. This is Melissa Arma with Stock Swoosh and I'm here today reviewing the QQQs. I had called a really nice option trade uh, a couple days ago, Thursday morning actually before the open. It was on the 8th here. Uh, the market gapped up in the QQQs and I called the 170 calls to buy the Qs out to the end of the month which really gives a very long time and we almost reached the strike into the close on Thursday and then we gapped up over the strike remember it was 170 open at 171.10 and immediately was up quite a lot in here and ran up now it's more than three dollars over the strike 173.16 so and, and there's weeks left in this and I think that's one of the things that's so nice about this trade uh, obviously, if you did this trade, you were up a lot on Friday, you could be out of it, but the market looks higher. And 175 is the next target here for this. When we hit it, I don't know. I mean, it could be in the next week. It could take more than that, but it's definitely going to hit 175. And I really like the fact that the Qs are stronger right now than the SPY, and this has moved over the high. It's going to get to the number a lot quicker. But it was a really nice call. And just to give you an example of the price of something, the cost of something, if you had paid two dollars for example for one um contract which would have been 200 bucks or if you paid two dollars which would have been two thousand dollars for 10 contracts or a thousand shares of the queues on this day and you would be up you would be up actually uh really really nicely here into the close and this is if you would have gotten out of it it would have been worth more than four so you would have had more than 100% return on investment within 24 hours. And in an option trade, that's fantastic. It's just absolutely fantastic. So I think a lot of people um, out there didn't really realize how quickly the market would make the turnaround, but we did. I just want to review here the fact that we had this drop-off day. Remember this, and everyone panicked in the world and said we're going to fall off a cliff. People were talking about a correction. I really don't talk like that. I really do not. Um, we just fell, okay? So we fell, and I don't talk about percentages, and I don't use percentages, and that's not part of anything that I do or teach. But anyways, we fell hard in here, and then it was a wait and see to see how we react, because you really don't know if we're going to continue to drop or not. This bounce in here didn't have any meaning to me at all. Um, and then we rallied up here, but this was the turnaround day really for me in the market. It was Valentine's Day, and we held in this even when we dropped off in here, and the cues are stronger than any of the other ETFs right now, which is very interesting. And here you have a great chart. I mean, you just have a fantastic chart here, as strong as a brick. Um, here you see the whole thing. I mean, we're just up, up, up. So we retested that air in the 200 period moving average and took off like a rocket. And we have not looked back and we made a new high on Friday. It's a great call. Great call that I made. And, uh, you know, again, how do you make money in the market? You make money in the market by being able to see where somebody's going to go and taking the train before it does it whether it's up or down. If you see that something's going to move higher, then you get in the stock or the market long before the move higher happens. If you see that something is lower, then you short the stock or the ETF before the drop off and the selling comes in. So that is really the easiest way to make money and the best way to make money. It's just that most people cannot predict where something's going to go or in what time frame. I'm very good at not only predicting where something's going to go, but even seeing that it's going to happen within the time that I'm predicting it, whether it's in the live day in a few minutes for a target when we day trade, or whether it's in an option trade that I call out in a week or sometimes several weeks like this one was, that I can see it's going to hit a number or go through the number and beyond. So next target for this is 175. Who knows when to get there? Beautiful move in the queues, queues, and the people that are in it um, that did do this and got out of it Friday, there was perfectly fine. Um, they're up a lot of money, although this really does actually still look higher and was up a little bit here in the post market, it looks like Friday night, 173.25. So we'll see what happens this coming week. Congratulations to everyone that did the trade. If you're interested in signing up for my Golden Gap course, I'm offering a special through tomorrow, Sunday, uh, Sunday, March 11th. If you sign up for the Golden Gap class for the end of March, for 24th and 25th, you would receive the options that are free to the end of this calendar year, 2018. Uh, cost of class is $5,499. If you want to sign up for the option letter separately, it's an annual subscription. It's one year whenever, from whenever you sign up. It's $2,999. You just get the trades emailed to you, and you have to manage them yourself. So congratulations, everyone, and been so far really a very good 2018. I'll just keep it up. 
I'm in a groove here and I will continue to stay focused. Thanks everyone for watching.